How's it going, everybody? I'm Drifty from Driftwood Gaming, and I'm joined with the lovely T. Hello. And we're going to be doing another entry into the five, uh, the fifth annual Driftwood uh, Game Jam, the 580J. And this one right here is called Whatever. Yeah. And it was made by. I want to show the page ooh, ooh, ooh. too. Somebody's on the stream. He's a dev. He made it. Where is he? Brian. Uh, B S P Virgo on Itch has created this game. Brian and Perez. Brian Perez. Brian, okay. Brian Perez. Yes. All right. So um, if you haven't rated the games, go rate them, play them, download them, show them some uh, attention. And uh, anyway, let's jump into whatever. Let me know if the sound is too quiet or too loud. Let's look at the options. Pretty basic stuff. Battle camera. Sure. Whatever. It looks like we're using an ATB on this. And let's jump into a new game of whatever. Uh, Rando. This place is disgusting. I need to go for a walk. Wow! Hey, look at this. This map is very um, well thought out, I think. And and wow, good job. I like the map. Good job. This it's is not a, this giant. Is an all right map. Yep. yep. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. I There's like stuff. It. You get this little pop up. There's Definitely sound. Definitely like using doodads or something because you know you could probably just do this Maybe. with base. Yeah, I don't think you need doodads to do true, this. True. Nope. This looks like it's just the editor. Are you sure? What about the hole on the table? You can do oh, that. Oh, and the book on top of the papers. Definitely do that. No, you can do that. With the editor? Yeah. No. You can have a certain number of layers, yeah. I'm not saying that for sure this uh -huh. was the editor, but like everything I see here, it looks like could have been done with the editor. Huh. Um, obviously, it'd be easier to do this with doodads because you don't have to take the like, tile set A, tile set B, tile set C, tile set D, and, and stack them. Yeah. But you can do like three or four layers with just the editor. It's not good. The editor sucks. Um, this looks like a default map. Is this a default map? Maybe. I think it's a sample map. But the whole point of this thing is to be default, so it's fine. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, it's all editor. Yeah. Death this confirmed. place. Yeah, that's what I thought. This place is no prize either. Rando, is that you? Rando. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is you. I need you to do something for me. Why not? I got nothing else to do. I need you to find the Lolly Dama. Her again? Why? I have an itch. I bet you do, dirty old man. No, 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 no. I mean a psychic like itch. Something is wrong here, but I don't know what. Please find her. Okay, okay, sheesh. I should have just stayed home. All right. So I don't think there's anything else, right? Because the things sparkle. The, yeah, things sparkle, and the yeah. chests look like chests. So I, I appreciate that. Like that might be something. Yep. More, More power. power. Let's look at it. Tim the Tool Man. That's what he says. More power. Wow. Yeah. Okay, Boomer. <laughs> Close yeah, until further notice. Myself. Anti venom. Close until further notice. This looks like a big bad guy. I need crystals. Gosh, get away from me, you tweaker. <laughs> I need my shit, man! What do you need? Let's get some heal ups. Yeah, we got enough to buy one. How about that? <laughs> Let's get. By some, I mean a up. single one. <laughs> All right. I need my crystals. My crystal baths. Yeah, check the garbage. It's always good stuff in the garbage. Stardew Valley taught me that. What? Uh, we don't have money, so there's no point in trying to buy armor right now. Ooh, no admittance. I like that there's sparkles on where you're supposed to go. I appreciate that. Yeah. Me Here's too. the ATB waiting to do things. Ice. Ice that slime. Hey, Sometimes... you know, simple step made the slime look better. They used a, a They hue. used a hue slider, yes. yep. And it just it looks better. Slime is supposed to be green. Oh no. <gasps> what? He probably did the exclude unused stuff uh -huh. and and uh, using plugins it doesn't consider like what was and used. And we can't it. fix that if we don't have the game file, or can we fix that? You know, what is it? Howl.png? Yeah. I mean, we obviously have all. Those oh my god. It's default. At least it's not in an Enigma box. If it was in an Enigma box, I definitely couldn't do anything. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna copy water, paste it, and name it howl.png. Alright? I hope there's only one. <laughs> I hope there's only one. Yeah. 
There's not. There's multiple. Oh, All right. No. Animations cure four. Let's copy cure one and just go like this and say. I'm not gonna do this for every game. I, if this becomes a thing. A couple, you know, just a couple times is fine. Is my one? game, my game does this. If you buy the soda, Thunder it bugs two. out. Because I went through everything except for my items looking for sound files. Oh wait. Uh, as this a sound. is sound. Yeah. Oh gosh, we're gonna be doing this a lot. Yeah. I don't we're think do I, so much. I'm gonna do a few of them, and yeah. if this becomes a big deal. What's up with this? Like Windows, Windows. 10. It's Windows. Why? Does that, you don't have this problem on Linux. You, you don't. don't. Have the problem you don't on, have, on Windows right. 7. It's very Windows annoying. 7 did that sometimes too. If there's a lot. Oh. It's just Windows thing. You know, it's got to initialize the view and the whatever. <laughs> Let's copy this, paste this. Thunder 2.ogg. Okay, retry. Oh no. Jesus Christ. This is not good. Brian, can you tell us? Uh, is this, I mean, how many of these are we going to run into? All Just of them. Just a few? Every I know that asset. mine had one. Mine had one. Just one. Copy all the folders. No, I ain't got time for that, Tony. Nobody got fucking time for that. Pull your game properly. <laughs> ain't nobody come to the stream to watch me do file transfers. They don't want to see me copy paste folders. Yeah, I remember doing the IGMC, it was uh, a repeated warning. Make sure your game has all the files to play, and uh, maybe we should have done that too. Just warned everybody. Make sure your game has all the files to play. Play test your own game, you know? Before you upload it, mm -hmm. here's what you do. You deploy it, you put that folder into zip file, okay? You do that whole process. Before you upload it, you right click and extract the zip file that you just fucking made, and then you open the folder and double click your game and play the whole game. That's where you play test, not in the engine. Yeah. You play test it like that, and then when that works, you upload that zip file that you confirmed works. That's the I, process. I didn't, I didn't use exclude files option. I went through each I didn't folder. either, that's why my, my game is four times larger than it needs to be. Well, no, but I went through and manually removed things, but I that's still missed one. That's the better way to one. do it. I yeah. still missed one, because I didn't think to look in the items. And uh, so if you if you buy the soda and try and drink the soda, it'll bug the game out. Now, if you're making a game for mobile, you definitely have to go ahead and, and exclude everything you possibly can. Because yeah. it's smaller. It needs to be smaller. So now I forgot what we're doing. We're looking for the Lolly Dama. That's right. Combat's not too bad, actually. I mean, it feels a little slow, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I think This fight else. especially is really slow. Yeah. ATB is just slow in general. You yeah. know, I don't recommend using ATB. I don't I, like the I don't like the turn based like, battle system in RPG. We're just waiting and waiting and yeah. waiting and waiting and waiting and I feel like there's very little you could do to make it good, honestly. Even the newer um, like Octopath Traveler systems that are out there. Yeah. To me I find them all boring. Yeah, I all don't. I like a good turn base, but uh, and I like a good ATV too, but it's so hard to get it right, you know, because it is. the numbers, it is. like, if you don't, if you make it too fast and the enemy gets too many turns, here's what I find much better, CTB. CTB is great because you can sit there and wait and strategically plan your next move, uh -huh. but then as soon as the next person is supposed to go, they go, right. they go, the You're next person goes. There's no up, bar feeling, yeah, yeah there, there's no watching a bar fill up. It's like we're watching yeah. endless loading screens. 
Uh, we grew up, I think, you know, the next generation is not going to see the appeal to it, but we grew up playing games like this. You know, like, I remember Six had an ATB, and it was fantastic, right? Six right. was great. It was. But, the, but, you know what? The gauge filled up really fast, even when, even at the beginning, and it just got better. It filled up a lot faster. Yeah. But I, I, I have to agree with Sky Arjon. I like the ABS system. Yeah, like ABS, bad. for those who don't know, it's like Legend of Zelda style yeah. combat, you yeah. know. Or beat em ups is kind of an ABS. CTB is, yeah, Heartless. CTB is like instant turn based. It still turns, but like the next person, the next person, the next person, the next person, and there's no waiting for bars to. You're not watching 100 loading screens for each combat. Loading screen. You know, like, if you think of what's the difference between watching an AT bar, loading screen. Yeah. You know what battle system I think, the turn-based battle system that I believe in all the games I've ever played with turn-based battle systems that got it absolutely, positively, perfectly right is Sakoden 2. Yeah. Their battle system, that, that battle was good. system is freaking incredible. I bet I could squeeze through here, that's what she said. If only, only I, I had, had something, something to make, to make myself, myself slippery. slippery. <laughs> Slime oil. <laughs> Gross. Oh, that's great. Yeah, Divinity 2's battle system is good, but um, I mean more of these. That's. These, that's I, I'm, I'm talking about the, the JRPG traditional turn based. First of all, Divinity 2 isn't really a turn based yeah. system, it is a tactical combat system. Yeah. Divinity 2 is amazing, but that's not your traditional turn based. It is turn based, but it's a tactical turn based. It's mm -hmm. kind of different. Oh yeah, check your equipment, uh, Brian says. Check our equipment? Yeah, battles might go a little easier if you have equipment. Okay. Equip. Can I do that in combat? No? Okay. I used ABS too. I think it's a good choice in a game where you have limited time because these battles take so long. I will say that trying to get a good ABS in RPG Maker is a fool's errand. <laughs> you guys are all fucking it's, insane. You know, I worked really hard for 30 days and it's still buggy. It's still buggy. There's like two... Two major bugs. You're wasting your of. time. You should yeah. just use uh, GMS2 or Godot. Right, but that's for the jam. For the jam, I understand. That's a that's a challenge though. A, there's not a lot of good ABS, and it's so incompatible with the, the large majority of resources out there. Yeah, I mean, I had to put long script calls. I had to modify plugins. I had to do some very weird, convoluted spaghetti eventing to get it to work as good as it does and it, it was hard and it was complicated and to be honest one of the thing one of the things I did when I look back at it I'm not sure how it works it does though it works MV is so good at a lot of things but ABS is not one of them it's true it's true it was fun though I, it was fun it was a good learning it. experience yeah. I I saw yeah. you I personally saw you get much better at the engine in general yeah from the beginning to the end of this jam and that's kind of the heart of what game jams are for is to improve your ability, improve your skill, improve your your yes, knowledge base. Exactly. Uh, so I think this jam did that for you, it, like one hundred percent. Oh, absolutely. I don't know if it made me much better. I I after you clock fifteen thousand yeah. hours and well, something. Well, you stayed in your comfort zone, though. I I went to the opposite. I went and did something that I normally don't do. Mm -hmm. um, in order for you to get out of your comfort zone, you would have had to make like a dialogue-based puzzle game or something. <laughs> Well, no, that would have been easy for me to do. I just personally don't like that, yeah. and so I didn't. Dialogue, come on, that's fucking easy. And puzzles, right, they can to be make hard. Engaging gameplay without the battle system, that would have been a challenge for you. Mm, it would have been a boring game to me. Other people may have liked some of the things uh -huh. like that, but I thought. It, listen, I don't want to make a game that I don't want to play. Right. I don't want to work on a game that I don't personally feel. Mm -hmm. is fun. I get it, I get it. And so that's why I've given up a lot of the project I've started working on. I'm like, this is no longer fun to play. No, he simply wouldn't do it, Doc Wees. <laughs> he doesn't have the patience to do something like that. <laughs> to do something like what? what? What I was just suggesting. Having to create what he hates. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. No, I couldn't <laughs> do it. Like, because I would feel that it sucks. Uh -huh. And like, this is freaking boring and I don't want to play it, you know? And so I wouldn't do it because I don't want to play it. I am out of healing items. 
and also MP. So uh -huh. there's a this is a problem in a game like this when you have these battles that that are like respawning and whatnot. So I can only heal. This is the last heal I get. So eventually now I'm going to die. Hopefully I can win this combat before I die. Yeah. You should probably save. I'm going to try to save can. after this fight. Please let me win. Please let me win. At least we're not getting the missing files error anymore. Yeah, it was just a few files. Yeah. Yes. Please let me win. Yes. Okay, now please let me save. Oh, we got a crystal <laughs> like that time. Cancer's trolling you. He says, Drifty, you should definitely make a visual novel. <laughs> yeah, no thanks. <laughs> not gonna happen. Okay, we got... Oh, we have one heal up. Did we just get that? I don't know. Maybe. We must have had it. Restore MP. I love it. Maybe Yay. more of those. Increase power. I'll take that. Give me all of those. Pretty. This is that what that one guy wanted. Give me crystal. Oh, yeah. Junk. We sell that. Maybe he'll give you something cool. I'm gonna save that heal until the last moment. Okay, that's great. That you actually know had how Drifty's visual novel would be? It would start off, it would have, you know, like a pretty screen and a bust, and the person would say, visual novels suck. The end. That would be it. Nah, I wouldn't even make that. <laughs> can I run? Unable. Let's see if I can get away in three yeah. turns. Should be able to get away in three turns, right? You can get away. Get away. Get away. No! Damn it. Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. Escape. No, no. That's all right. Let's, I might as well. I could have killed him by now, That's right? Sad. I could have fucking killed him by now. <laughs> save points are good in that it reminds the player to save without having to right. show text. So you do a, a mix of both uh, menu saving and save points, in my opinion. I let the player save anywhere in most of my games. But then at the same time, I will put a save point just to remind the player to save without actually having to put it in text. I think in Dungeons of Driftwood, I actually did remind the player like with text. I'm like, hey, you're going to fight the assassin. Save the game. He can just straight assassinate your ass. That's why you save it. I'm like, hey, remember, you can save anywhere. Mm -hmm. I thought about doing autosave on my game, but, you know, I ran out of time. Too many features. Autosave is a tough one to get right. Yeah. I didn't want to open that can of worms when I had, like, three days left. And I, to be honest, I only had a solid two hours a day, really, to work on it after the baby went to sleep. I would have loved to have worked on it more, but it just simply isn't possible to concentrate when you got so many other things going on throughout yeah. the day. Yeah, you're, you worked on it a lot. Yeah. You worked on it. Orders of magnitude more than I worked on mine. Yeah. Mine was like uh, four hours on a day, a couple hours here, a couple hours there. I probably only worked about 20 to 30 hours on a total mm -hmm. from start to finish. That's yeah. about it. So I would say maybe 30 hours. I probably worked on mine about 60 to 80 hours. I would no, say. like 100. Maybe 100. Yeah, yeah, you worked on it like 100 hours. Yeah. Easy. You're just a pile of bones. How are you going to stop me? You want to be Geraldine? Sure. You want to find out? Bring it on. Oh, she looks fun. I want to have a party with Geraldine. What was it? A chicken? The chicken save point? Yeah, the chicken save point was awesome. I love it. Heartless made him a bat. Yeah, I'm going to have to say, if you are entering a jam where the judges are only obligated to play 30 minutes of your game... Make your game, aim it for 20 minutes. Well, yeah, and don't put a bunch of fights all over the place that are going to take a few minutes apiece, because really, that's all you're showcasing. You're, but, <sighs> Unless that's part of the... You know, maybe you have a battle rush. Yeah, if it's just a battle rush, rush that's Shit. fine. But this game apparently has a story. What's the story? We probably won't find out because the, the battles are just taking. Well, we so have long. another ten minutes. We do, yes. Yeah, so hopefully we can get somewhere. If we die, that's not gonna help. The game is probably only three minutes long, but or you it, add this many fights. Yeah, yeah. And it, you got to remember, encounter rate is random. If you're gonna do random encounters. Um, like, this game is not doing our no, random no. encounters, but if you're going to do random encounters, 
um, then you have to be prepared to have a large varying degree of the amount of combat that the player is going to have. Yeah. They may get no battles, they may get ten battles. It's hard to really yeah. um, to tell. I, I like to script them. If you're going to put a lot of battles in, you know, by, by all means, go for it. But make it fast. Like, don't give them a lot of Yeah, this points. is this, the combat is not good in this it's game. It's too long. Like, at first I thought it was alright because the first enemy was quick, but some of the enemies are just way too long. Yeah. And you should get a move that takes 100 TP that just, just completely annihilates everything. So if the player gets to 100 TP in a combat, it's probably gone on too long, unless you're using preserved TP. And, and then let them finish it, you know what I mean? 100 TP for a move, and it just like, bing, 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 bing. Uh, you know, it's an action sequence. That's what I did in mine, too. I'm like, I want my act I want my uh, 100 TP moves to just kill and end the fight. Yeah. Of course, it was a boss battle rush with only about six or seven fights. No, it was ten fights. But um, it was like six or seven enemies. The devs saying once we beat Geraldine, we can get to the final boss. Are okay. we going to have any, like, ability to heal at the final boss? I have some, uh... Heal up? Oh no, I used it. I think you used it, yeah. we might, I might have got more. I feel like my TP is completely wasted. I should have had a, a stronger TP move, because yeah. this sucks. Yeah. It doesn't do enough damage. It doesn't... You know, it's like, what's the difference between that and my basic attack? It's like 20 damage or something? You know, it's not great. Yeah. Bang. 20 damage, 23 damage. So, Sky or Joran, if we go back to the store, we're definitely not finishing the game in time. Because, like, these, these enemies, no. they respawn. You got eight fighting minutes. your way out and yep. fighting your way back. It's not going to happen. If the fights go faster, you put equipment on. We're, we're, uh, the player doesn't know that. <laughs> the player doesn't know that. Yeah. You have to drip emote it and put, like, a little window assume that says, that says you're, equipped. <laughs> assume your player is a fucking moron, okay? And here's what you should do. Put in a, a line of code that automatically equips your equipment. Mm -hmm. Easy. Yeah. Fucking easy. I didn't notice you getting equipment, honestly. I didn't even notice it either. Yeah. Why don't you just put it on when the player starts? You did it! Alright. Now put your equipment on. Shadow Ring. Okay, so we get stuff. Oh god, we almost got into another fight immediately. <laughs> okay, optimize. All I have is an ammo clip. Yeah. That just changed my attack by 10. That's it. I got a Shadow Ring. Uh, but that I think just attack doesn't. Attack is better. Yeah, attack. Yeah. Improve your attack power. So you did have your equipment on. Yeah, all I didn't have on was one ammo clip. So that's not even a good excuse right there. I will save it though. Yes. Let's... Unfortunately, we have to fight again because he's in the way here. Uh, he's just a little slime. Yeah, he should die fast. Attack. And we missed. ATBs are slow for one. The, the numbers aren't quite balanced right. Um, we don't have good number of skills. We need at least one more good TP skill. Yeah, Vino, I agree. This is why watching somebody play your game is so valuable because you take so much for granted when you develop your own game and you have to assume that the person playing it literally knows nothing take nothing for granted so if this is a vital feature that they need to encounter you need to make them encounter it yes it's you can't just assume important. well they will everyone's obvious you should do this no right. it's don't assume Nothing's it's obvious, obvious to you because you put it together yeah but it's not obvious to everyone Okay, I think I got that. I got that. And then I have to go down here. No, I don't, huh? No. I don't want to fight. I don't feel like one treasure is worth a fight right now. Yeah. Because we have like seven minutes, six minutes. Gosh, darn it. There's so many So after things. I do this, I hit a switch. I have to fight it. Yeah. Just get it over with. But the thing is, I'm almost out of items, right? Yeah, I've got no more items. And I'm on a limited number of uh, MP, so I should never have been using ice. Yeah. I should have only been using basic attack and heal. And heal. Yep. Yeah. So More that's items. a big mess up right there. And I've watched about a thousand loading screens in this 30 minute period because of every time you wait for a turn is ATB. I, I always tell people don't don't use ATB. Yeah. It's too slow. Yeah. It's too slow in a modern era right now.
And the name is ironic because it's called active turn battle. But it's not active at all. It's very passive. Yes, it's very passive. It should be called it, it should be called PTB. I mean just uh, figuring passive out, turn figuring battle. out what you're gonna do takes long enough in between attacks. Don't need to add time to that. Oh that's a dead end oh, fucking stupid shit. <laughs> And you can't run. I've tried to escape three times in a row. Uh, there's another. There's another sound, should... sound bite for you guys. <laughs> yeah, it should be called loading turn loading battle. Loading turn battle. I agree. Flexes us. I agree. That's a better name. <laughs> no, we're gonna game over actually. Yeah. Which is appropriate because we're out of time pretty much. We're gonna game over because we're gonna be out of items. We're gonna be um, out of MP, and no way to get out without encountering several battles. Another thing you should do is not have the battles respawn. Don't have them respawn. Or make it a switch that resets so they do respawn, but only if you visit the store. Mm -hmm. So if you talk to the store NPC, that turns the battles back on. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Something like that, a failsafe. Because look, I can't even... I have to be very... Run! Ninja! Woohoo! <laughs> I think uh, some Was of that... his enemies are freezing like mine do. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> oh, oh, you oh. had it! I panicked, you okay? Had it. I fucking panicked! Yeah, I'm so bored. I'm fucking bored. You know what would be good in this plug is a uh, Sound Cipher's plugin. What's that? It uh, it's a plugin where you press shift and everything runs at double speed or yes. like fifty percent increase. Yes. So all the animations are faster. Uh, it doesn't change the pitch on the the, the uh, sound. The S. The, so the sound effects are still regular. But the animations and the movements and action sequences and dialogue and almost everything is is forced to run faster. Yes. So I think um, in an ATB, Sound Cipher's uh, all it's it's toggleable by the player too. So you put it in, and the player can press Shift to enable it. And then while it's enabled, while it's enabled, you can. Uh, See, in the note, in the top left, there'll be a little thing, you know, and so the player can enable it if they need to, and if and. You found junk food. Is that a healing item? Don't go down. Oh, uh, uh, I can't go back to the store. Wait, no, you go up. But oh. what about this green thing? What is that? I don't know because I, it, I don't know if it was there. Was that a heal yeah, point? Yeah, no, it was there. I don't know what it is though. It. You 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 touched it before. Did I? Yeah. Okay, but so I, it, maybe it's an it MP is. heal point. Please go up. Yes. Fucking yes. Is it? It's a free nice. heal. That's really good. Okay, save it. Awesome. I'm glad that's there. Ah. That was very well thought out to put a free heal point in there. Good job. Um, go up, not over. Please go up. Please go up. Please go up. Just go up. Yes. Yeah. Okay, you. Go up. Yes. <laughs> so like we Yay. hit the switch, right? Give the guy the crystal. Yeah, oh, we have the Is that what switch. we're supposed to do? I don't know, but I know we could. Oh wait, now that we have money. Yeah, let's get stuff. We have a thousand dollars. Rando plus ten. What defense? Hard helmet plus fifteen. I think the helmet's better because we get fifteen. So let's go with the helmet and some items. Yeah, we got a lot of defense. We're gonna take a lot less damage unless it's magic attack based. Um, go, to, go to the crackhead. Go to the crackhead. No, head. that's gonna be the fight. Is it? I think, right? I, no, you're looking for the Lamy Dama. No, I'm looking for a store to buy healing items. Okay. Because I've got money. I don't want to get into a fight. Oh, it's right here. I want to get some healing potions, okay. some magic potions. And save before you, uh, before yeah. you talk. Yeah. Magic up. One, two, three, four, and then I guess a couple of these. Okay. Uh, he says there's a chest outside the shop. Oh, yeah. Oh, I do. I see it. Yeah, okay. Five hundred. That's good. Maybe we can get a better weapon because I feel like attacks. Gosh, that you need to do yeah. more damage. Your guy is weak or as people shit. Need less hit points. Yeah, one or the other. Guns. Oh. No. Can you sell something? Maybe. Do you have anything to sell? Maybe. 
What can I sell? Um, has many practical uses. Loot, junk, sell it. Oh, it's not worth it very much. I'm not selling my items. I just bought those. Yeah. Okay. Well, whatever. Uh, we got some. We got some friggin' items now. We have more defense, right? We've got. Please be the last boss, cause it's already 30 minutes. Uh, what's it to you? I'll give you 1,200. Why not? Sweet. Hey. Oh. You just got money to buy a gun. Well, then what the fuck do I do now? I don't know. I don't know where to go. You're supposed to get the lobby daba. I got all of this. I'm ready for the last boss, man. Guns, buy. Best gun. Got it. Hell yeah. Okay. 15 more defense, 10 more attack. Was I... there somewhere else in the sewer we were supposed to go? Yeah, I didn't see the thing. I don't know where to go. Hold oh, on. Do I have no. enough to get the next armor as well? I think I do. Buy the heavier shirt? Yes. And then what's this? Yeah, we go back to the sewer. Okay. Okay, I just got 25 defense Maybe the and 10 will attack. Maybe be more bearable now. And I have items. I think we're going to be in a better position to just smash some, some enemies. I'm still going to try smash to avoid... Smash some fruit. Yeah, I'm about to be Gallagher all over this shit. Alright, so we did a switch. All right. I, obviously, there's like a door or something down here that we missed. Yeah, something. Alright, blind shot. Please die fast. Go to the right. There's a door. Hell yeah! Did you see that? 250 oh yeah. Way damage. better. Way better. That's how the battle should be to begin with. Start the player with a gun. With, a, with ten. All you need is 10 more attack, basically. To the right? There's no door. I don't see a door. Fucking what? <laughs> Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Not a big deal. We're, so, we're a lot stronger now. Nice. Much better. The first time was painful. Shadow Dragon, we've only played a few games, and even if we didn't play uh, just a few games, I would definitely be not revealing that answer on the stream. What is the top three? I mean, we've only played five. Yeah, and or even six. even if we played forty of them, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say. Yeah, that's what the reveal video yeah. is for. You can make your own assessment. I see a door, Brian. What? By the entrance of the sewer. Is it is it that bars? The bars right there at the top. I don't Did those know. those come down? Is that it? Wow, yes. that was Put sparkles not, there. Yeah, that was that not. That looks like decoration. No. So you want to find the Bali Baba? Dolly Baba? Lolly Baba? Lolly Dama. Lolly Dama? What is it to you? <laughs> to get her, you have to get through me. Alright, fine. Oh god. She's pretty. Alright, attack. Yeah, we've gone on for over 30 minutes on this game, but I've, I've got this investment bias and we're going to end the stream after this, so I feel yeah. like we should get to the end, at least try, try to, to. but yeah. it's going to lose points for taking this long. I also, think as a general rule, we'll probably play a little more than 30 minutes just because we're streaming as well. No, I'm not saying as a general rule, no. Well, no but I will play 30 minutes or I will beat it. And, and at the most. Yeah. Or if it bugs out and you can't beat it, then there's no 30 minutes of right, wasting time. Right, right. Yeah, we can't, we can't help it if it bugs. I can't guarantee I'll play 30 minutes of your game. So far, two of them have bugged this one and the first one we played, but we were able to get past it. It's going to lose a few thankfully. points for not doing that right. It's going to lose, uh, or at least, you know, a point or two. It's going to lose points for taking too long and some other things, but it's not the worst game i played. It's actually... Not you know, yet, so it's alright. It's okay. It's yeah. alright. I mean, it's it's not super fun. It's boring at times. I think the numbers need to be checked. Um, the fights are too long. There's too many of them. They shouldn't respawn. There's a lot of things I could say good and bad about it. Um, I think he needs a, a like 80 TP or 100 TP move that just does a lot of damage. Yeah. His blind shot is kind of... Puny. It's not as good as... Yeah. As it should be. You did it. Okay. You are the victor. That's called the sunken cost fallacy, and it's dangerous all around. Yeah, I mean, this is how they get you at slot machines, too. <laughs> You've already put so oh, much money in, and you want to put more money. You think you're going to hit. Hello, Rando. The old man has asked for you. Says something is wrong. I know. 
Let's go to him. Okay. Ando. Thank you for eliminating backtrack. That's a good thing. You get a point for that. Yes. Endo. You came. Of course I did. Hearts. And I know what is wrong. You do? You no longer belong here. Hmm. Long ago, you made me a promise. When the time came, you would come to my realm and spend eternity with me. Do you remember that? Of course I do. Will you still keep that promise? I will. Good. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Don't worry, Brando. It's for the best. Wait. Okay. And everything lived happily ever after. Well, I guess we should go home. That's cool how the map's cleaned up, though. I like that. We're still poisoned. We're still poisoned. We're damage. We fall. <laughs> Game over here. We die from poison damage. <laughs> well, this place looks much better now. I guess it was all worth it. Damn old man. Kept we made it to the end. I don't understand the story. I don't Does either. It, it's stupid to me. But the game wasn't that bad. Yeah, Good yes. job. Thank you so much for yep. making the game and participating see, in the game jam. See, there was a lot jam. of work put into it. And yeah, I appreciate I mean, it, that. It definitely had some ups and downs. Yep. The end. Cool. All right. Um, Breva locks. And everybody else involved, whoever, whatever. Good job. That's good job, job, job. That's where we're going to end today's live stream. Thank you guys for coming to the live stream. Um, if you would like us to play your game on stream, that's the reward for the $20 tier on our Patreon. Links are in the description below. And then you game over at the end, of wow. course, right? <laughs> what is that? Psych, you actually lose. Here's a <laughs> twist at the, at the end of the game. <laughs> that's you lose. funny. It's sad. It's so sad. You lost the game. Yeah, you lost. Get good, scrub. Try better. Try try better next time. Oh, Life is Cancer figured it out. He said, I didn't get the story at all, but whatever. Look at the title. Whatever, dude. Huh? It's my United States of whatever. Huh? <laughs> okay. Now I'm really aging myself. Let's we'll see if anybody gets that reference. Yeah. Uh, sure. Where was I? Thank you guys for coming to the live stream. Uh, that's it. We're going to end the video. We're going to end the live stream. Love you guys very much. Thank you so much for coming. We'll see you guys tomorrow at 2 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to read off the names of the chat. But that's going to be it for this video. So thank you so much. Like, favorite, share, subscribe, or whatever you like to do. Do those things and uh, support the channel. We have a Patreon. You can get us to play your game. Uh, you can also join us on Discord where you can get us to play your game without any money. And uh, yeah, we'll see you. Bye, guys. Bye.